Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to open up a huge box of Cincy that came in. I have not opened it yet. And I'm, this is like probably the biggest box I've ever gotten, but it's not all mine. <coughs> I can't even lift it all the way up like that. It's not all mine, not all of it. Quite a bit of it, but not all of it. I'm not that crazy. <laughs> the sun is giving off very weird vibes in this video, yeah? Woohoo! Alright. <clears throat> I got the March with box. I'm going to put this in a new video. In a different video, excuse me. <clears throat> and then, oh man, okay. Oh, one of them was opened. All right. So we have a Fiesta Lime Counter Clean. We have Clothesline. We have Windowsill Breeze of a Laundry Liquid. This is definitely mine. I gotta try and remember what I bought <laughs> versus what everyone else got. Okay, so I got Windowsill Breeze. I remember liking this one. I couldn't remember if I loved it or not in the wax form, but I do think I said something about it being really awesome in a, uh, a laundry form. So I got a laundry bundle. So I'm very excited to try this out. <clears throat> Actually, you guys are here. Woo! It is getting hot here in Florida. So hot. Like that sun beating down on me. It's so hot. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. That is pretty. That is like super clean, crisp. Kind of, is it citrusy? I can't remember what the scent notes of this are, is, but oh man, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> then we have a counter clean in Johnny Appleseed and a counter clean in Blue Grotto. Pretty sure most of this is mine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How did I get seven? They just throw in an extra one or did I order it? Oh, I ordered it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Cannot remember things. So I wanted to try some new scent circles. These are perfect, perfect for us. Uh, I don't drive the car that much. Typically on the weekends, we're in the car a lot, driving here, there, doing things, going to Disney, all that kind of stuff. And so a scent circle is perfect because I'm not driving to work every day or driving you know, to daycare, or doing daily tasks in the car. So these are perfect. I pop one in on a Friday and it lasts us through the weekend and they last longer than that, but I'm not in the car that much. Occasionally I'll run somewhere here and there, but um, hopefully that'll change soon. But for right now, we're just kind of chilling. <laughs> trying to minimize how much we go out all together but anyways okay so we got a snapdragon scent circle mad for melon scent circle iridescent pearl which I, I love this scent it's just in wax form it's so light so I'm curious I might have already tried this one I cannot remember though for the life of me and then I got an I'm snow over it which I think I forgot to put in my club again or for when we were switching over to spring and summer I think I forgot it and I love that smell uh pina colada cha-cha I want to like put that one in there when we're on the way to the beach or something paradise punch Havana cabana yes yes okay then <laughs> I was out of these. Okay, so most of this in here might be mine. Oh, I got a Southern Sweet Tea Car Bar. 
they were having a sale, so I wanted to try it. By the way, check out the clearance section. You can always find some really good stuff in there. Especially if it's stuff like you've wanted to try, but you just never really wanted to pay full price for it because you weren't sure if you'd like it. I think those are perfect. Okay, I'm out of these. I'm very excited to open all these because <laughs> we need one downstairs but desperately. Um, these are the, I call them, what do I call them? Like AirPods or something? It's not, it's not they're called Scentsy Pods. So I got a Johnny Appleseed. And some of these I may have tried before. Oh gosh, so good. Squeeze the day. My favorite. Oh yes. Yes, 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 yes. Clean breeze. I haven't tried this one. This smells good. I don't like it as much as I like clothesline, but it, it still has the same kind of vibe. Very clean, very crisp, but very laundry smell. It's gonna smell really nice downstairs when people walk in. Iridescent Pearl. I love this one. I just, I, I'm hoping it, oh, that, sm that smell, it's just, it's so good. It's so different and unique. Very summery vibe. I love it love it uh pink haze this was i think this was on sale love pink haze it's so good so good it's very girly sweet hazy <laughs> no. it kind of reminds me a little bit of like cotton candy here even though it, to me it doesn't smell like cotton it's like sugar is this the one that has like whipped marshmallow? Uh, if this was a body spray, I would I would wear it all the time. I love that one. Hibiscus pineapple. Oh, so good. So yummy. It's so good. Uh, I love fall and winter the best, but I'm very, very excited that there are some summer scents <laughs> that is that are gonna be warmed in our house here. Oh lemon verbena oh so good so good i don't think i've ever tried this in wax form so good so so good i want to say i've tried that one but i don't remember There's so much stuff you know uh blue grotto dish soap the dish soap is super nice it lasts such a long time I'm just like tearing my nails apart. Okay, well, I can't, I can't open that, so. I did get a blue grotto in the wax form though. And I'm gonna talk about all the waxes in just a minute. So this was on clearance and I wanted this one and I just, I never got it cause I was into, I got the Jack Skellington one, which I love for Halloween, but this is really pretty for fall. So what is it? Lumina, Lumina? Um, so I, I never got it and then I saw it in the clearance section and it kind of freaked me out for a second because I was like, uh, is it gone? Like, is it going to be gone gone? So I went ahead and bought one. My mom has this one too. She loves it. It's so cute. And I start decorating for fall and Halloween <laughs> in August. So I don't care what you have to say about that. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. This one's unique because like you can't, for the wax, the cotton balls are gonna be best for this one because there's not a dish. But I love this for the fall. It's gonna be so cute in our new little house. I'm so excited. Very excited. All right, I'm gonna put all this away later. You know what? I think I'm gonna show you guys the March Wish box. I changed my mind. I'm gonna show it to you just because I've been slacking on videos like a lot <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and show you that in this video I'll package this later I'm gonna show it to you in this video um, because I have oh, so how long has spring and summer uh, been out like the scents been out the catalog 
since January or was it February? And I haven't gone over all of the scent notes. I haven't even smelled all of them yet. Like they're sitting in the bag and I really want to do that. So, and just finding the time right now to do them is, it's kind of crazy. So I want to go ahead and I'm going to do the March, the, the March Whiff box with this haul that I have. And then I'm going to start working on getting the, um, the scents, the categories, the scent categories. There's so much wax in here and this is not all mine. I know that for a fact. Um, okay, so we have a Johnny Appleseed. So good, so so delicious. This is crisp apple. It's so good, so good. Crisp, like red delicious apple. I feel like that one would be so good mixed with uh, like cinnamon bear, if you like cinnamon. Uh, but I just, I love it so much on its own. <laughs> It's like the perfect August scent. And then even in September, you could start adding a little bit of like spice to it. Guys, so good. I better remember to look at the camera. I'm all over the place today. Okay, so this one was one of the first ones I got uh, when we were living in Texas and it has fond memories of uh, when Brooklyn was a newborn. And so I don't have A is for Apple, which is my all time, all time favorite. I really want it to come back. I keep voting for it, but not enough people like it, I guess. But it has such a fond memory of bringing Brooklyn home. And so I'm trying to, I don't know, I'm trying to do that now with scents that I warmed when she was a newborn. So I got Blue Grotto. So this is gonna bring back memories. Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> it's like sweet. Some people say it's like candy. I don't think it's sweet like that. It's got, cit yeah, it's got a lot of citrus notes in it. And it's, uh, it's just, it's so good. It brings back memories, memories. I warmed this one in her nursery in Texas. It just has such, such fond memories. And Coco Lime. This is so good. This is so good. It bright, zesty lime. It's like coconut milk, and it's, it's got some kind of like cream or sugar in it, and it just oh, it's amazing. Oh, amazing! Another Johnny Apple seed. So good. Then we have hibiscus pineapple. This is very, very, very pretty. This is very pretty. Very like a resort feel, kind of like upscale-ish feel. It's got floral, pineapple. It's just, it's very, it's very like Hawaiian almost. Ah, I wanted to try this one. Tangerine creamsicle, creamsicle. So you know I have orange dreamsicle in my club. Oh yes. Oh my, I'm gonna have to pick between this one and that one. Oh my, yes. So it does remind me of Orange Dreamsicle. It's just tangerine. It's literally like a tangerine uh, popsicle with like, or tangerine ice cream, ice cream, or it's like vanilla ice cream and then it's dipped in tangerine like sugar. <laughs> like a tangerine popsicle, and then on the inside there's vanilla. Oh, that is so pretty, oh man, oh man, new favorite. That's lovely, that is really pretty. Oh, I love that one, look, look at the color, like it's got like the little popsicles on it. Color's so pretty. So the next two are also ones that I got. I think I got like a, I got a bundle and save. So I got like three, three of them. And these, what am I trying to say? I got three Scentsy bars and these next two that I'm talking about along with Blue Grotto, it was part of the ones that I had and was warming and sparingly using when I had Brooklyn. This is delicious. This is, I know this is very, this is a fall winter type scent, but baked apple pie. I had a yawn. <laughs> so
so good. Cinnamon is literally like baking an apple pie. I mean, you guys, oh, so good, so yummy, so yummy. Brings back memories, man, I tell you what. And it was so cold too in Texas, it was so cold. Like when we had her, it would get down to like the 20s, the 30s, the 40s, and we would just open the door and I had Scentsy going and it just, it brings back such good memories. Black Raspberry Vanilla. So this is, <laughs> this one is such a classic and this is another one that I warmed when she was a baby. Mm, so, so good. This is, this has been around for a hot minute, I believe. So good. It's black raspberries and vanilla. It's not super sweet. It's very fruity. It's delicious. I feel like you could mix this with something. I mean, it's really good by itself, but I feel like you could mix this with something and it would just be, it would just make it even that better, that much, that much more better. I don't know. I can't speak today. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The black raspberry with the vanilla and the tangerine guys i like this one you could mix with almost anything though like blue grotto would be good with coco lime it would be good with definitely a good one <gasps> magnolia linen i wanted to try this one too i really gotta do those videos where i'm smelling the testers mm -hmm, mm -hmm. delicious not delicious very clean very strong, very powerful. It's almost like a feminine version of um, clothesline, but it's definitely got some floral in it. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. I can picture having the windows open somewhere and someone's like doing laundry and gorgeous, gorgeous scent. If you like clothesline, clean breeze, if you like the windowsill breeze, all that kind of stuff, definitely get that one. Okay, peach nectar. Oh man, that smells good. I don't wanna touch it. <laughs> this one isn't mine. Oh man, that is so pretty. Oh wow. I'm not sure I've worn this one before. Oh, that is so good. That is like fresh peaches, fresh peaches. Like biting into a fresh peach with the skin and all. Oh, so good. I'm gonna have to get that one now. <laughs> Pina Colada Cha Cha. This is a Pina Colada. Literally walking onto a cruise ship, going up to the bar, asking for a Pina Colada, and, and that's what it is. You don't get like rum, but oh man, that is, that's delicious. So fruity, so perfect for summertime. And then we've got sea salt and avocado. This is one that I wanted to try too. Well, actually I have tried this one, but I wanted it again. It's just, it's such a unique smell. Like you would think it would be like grass <laughs> and I don't like the salty smells like, like ocean smells, but this is so good. It's like fresh avocado. It's slightly sweet. I think it's got like, what is it, like Himalayan salt or something. So good. It's just so fresh. It reminds me of like the springtime, you know, like leading into summer. So <laughs> that's it for the haul. But let me go ahead and talk about the whiff box real quick here. <clears throat> this whiff box is huge. And I have not seen any cheats. I have not watched any other videos of anybody else. I haven't even seen it on Instagram, which is just crazy. <clears throat> oh man. Oh, what? Okay. So this is a little pamphlet that it comes with. Spring is in the air and you know what that means, spring cleaning. And you know what's funny is I just put about $50 worth in my Walmart shopping cart. We do the Walmart pickups because it's just easier with uh, a child. And <clears throat> I have like $50 worth of cleaning supplies because I am pretty much all out and I have been wanting to do spring cleaning. Maybe that's why I've got that itch. Just want everything gone. <laughs> I 
and I just want it all super super clean like I want to vacuum like every other day I'm just like obsessed with cleaning right now so that's funny that's funny okay so this is a chore game who says cleaning needs to be boring if you're not the type to get excited about vacuuming and organizing you're not alone so let's mix things up and have a little fun cut Cut out these cards, throw them in a box or a jar, and make a game out of cleaning. It's your house, so you make the rules. Isn't that cool? I really like this. So they've got like, you can cut out these little squares. And they've got like, tidy as much as you can in 15 minutes. Lend a helping hand to the person of your choice. It's your lucky day, no chores for you. This is perfect if you have kids who are like a little bit older. Oh, majority rules the rest of the family picture chore today. Who can clean the most in 30 minutes? Oh, I love it. Tackle chore you haven't done in a while. Oh, I love that idea. Love that. So you can cut all these out, put them in a jar, and then everybody takes one. Perfect. What is this? It's a Swedish dishcloth. You guys, that is so cool. It's a washcloth. A washcloth? It's a washcloth. Oh, I love these things. Like, you can't buy these. <gasps> that is so cool. A Swedish dishcloth. Isn't that funny? It's almost like, it's like part foam, part paper. Oh, I love that. That is so cool. Reusable and biodegradable dishcloth. Great for wiping down counters and surfaces or cleaning up spills. Simply rinse or machine wash and air dry. It's made in Germany. Ha! Huh. Isn't that awesome? I love that. Ooh. <laughs> so let's see. So we've got a lemon verbena counter clean. We have a Fiesta Lime dish soap. We have Squeeze the Day bathroom cleaner, which is funny because I'm out of bathroom cleaner. I just finished it. Oh, oh my gosh. These are like the perfect scents too, like the citrusy ones. Oh yeah. And then you have Pink Sugarberry Mint, which I've smelled before. I believe I did it with you guys. Oh, that smells good. <gasps> they changed their wax, like the the clamshell. It show. Look at that. I don't know if they all look like that now. No, maybe like just the newer ones. <gasps> like it's got like for the woods, the fresh, the bake. Oh, that is so cute. I didn't notice that. I wonder if that's new. It actually smells pretty good in the wax form right here. It's not as minty as I remember last time. It's very sweet and like grilly and berry. I'm excited. I'm excited. So you get um, a scent of the Scentsy Month. This is actually a really good deal. I'm going to add it up for you guys in a minute. Okay. Plumeria Peach. When I found out that it was gonna be a peach note. And I actually, I like Plumeria if it's not too strong. Um, I have high hopes for this one. <gasps> oh, wow. <gasps> I love that. Great, another one to put in my club. Oh, I love that. It reminds me of something. Hold on. It reminds me of a scent that I've smelled before. It's not exact, but it does remind me of something that I've smelled before. And I want to say it was one of the summertime ones, like one of the summertime special ones. That is delicious. Oh, is it hibiscus uh, waters? No. Oh, this is delicious. This is like a sweet and tart peach all at the same time. And... Oh, and the color is pretty. It's got plumeria in it. Oh, guys, that is delicious. Oh, I'm going to need a bard of that. <laughs> oh, yes. 
That did not let me down. I'm very excited about that. Oh, I'm gonna have to put that in our bedroom today. <laughs> that smells so good. Okay, so let me add all this up for you. Let me get my calculator. Okay, I'm back. I just had a moment of panic. Um, so whenever I have my Bluetooth in, and when I am doing one of these videos, typically it won't play back correctly. And I forgot to take my Bluetooth out and turn my Bluetooth off, but luckily it was saved. It, it worked. My little microphone took over automatically. So <laughs> praise the Lord. Um, <laughs> uh, let's see. It's not as fun to watch it again. Like if you know, you filmed it incorrectly and then you have to ax the prize again, or you have to just like tell them that, yeah, I've already smelled all this. So let me just go ahead and tell you about it. <laughs> so anyways, okay. So I got my calculator. Now, I can't count the little dish rag, and I can't count the sample, because you can't buy those. But we can count the, uh, the bar, so it's $6. And then you have the counter clean, which is $10. Then you have the dish soap, which is $10. And you've got the bathroom cleaner, which is $8. So that's a total of $34. Um, really great deal, this one. Um, so typically you get your, oh, and you get a little game, a little game and your little pamphlet. But typically the whiff boxes are uh, $30. I get mine for $15 uh, through my Scentsy Club. If you want to know more about that, let me know and I can tell you all about it. You have to spend a certain amount and then you get a half off item in the whiff box count. So I get mine for $15. They, mm, I didn't get it for $15 with this haul, but uh, through the Scentsy Club, it's one of the Scentsy Club perks. So definitely let me know if you want to know about more about that. Um, yes. So you get the two bars, the sample of the bar, and then you get all these cleaning products. And I love, love our cleaning products. So much so that I have not purchased any other type of spray counter clean unless it was like in a dire need and I didn't have any backups and I was waiting on an order. So I love their stuff. Their bathroom cleaner is also really great. I've even been like spraying it in the toilet and using it to clean the toilets and all of the like, black underneath comes right off so and then it smells delicious too so i love our counter stuff or our cleaning cleaning line uh not as much as the wax but right up there and then the dish soap they they last forever for me love it and fiesta lime this is one this is a really good one this is a really good one uh yeah so that's it so that is the march whiff box i showed you the haul yeah so thank you guys so much for joining me and i am going to try and get out more videos as soon as i possibly can but i really appreciate you guys watching me <laughs> and even clicking on the link i really appreciate it but if you have any questions my contact information is down below thanks so much for watching i'll see you in my next one bye